Four hundred armed noblemen, Honoré? If it weren't for General Enough. Lafayette... Enough! The room is fogged with your bluster! All hot air and no action! Here's a man with good news, I think. Arno, what did you learn from the silversmith? Poison. They're catching up. Germain made that pin, and others like it, for a man named Lafreniere. Sure. Certain. Grandmaster de la Serre spoke highly of his loyalty. Very well. I suppose the course is clear, Arno. Find Monsieur Lafreniere. I have done so already, Monsieur. He is no threat. What are you saying, Pispa? I had a lead on Lafreniere. I followed it, and I killed him. Unthinkable. What the hell were you thinking? How dare you defy the The next time you shut in the council, I'll we'll rip you a new arsehole! While this council admires your zeal, it is not your place to choose your own targets. You should have reported your findings to us. Forgive me, mentor. I believed I had found the man who ordered Monsieur de la Serre's murder. When I discovered further evidence that suggested he was about to strike at the Brotherhood in force, I took action. Believed? Suggested? I am no longer certain of Lafreniere's motivations. In his memories, I saw him writing the letter that would have warned Monsieur de la Serre of his betrayal. When he spoke of his impending attack, he mentioned a club in the Marais, not one of our safe houses. What do you make of this? I cannot say. I would like to investigate further. I don't like this. The boy is a gifted assassin, but I fear he's obsessed with a private vendetta. Let another follow this lead. We don't have time. Whatever Lafreniere was planning, it happens tonight. He did ask permission this time, Guillaume. Ah. Uh. Go then, see what you can learn, but no more rash action. Hm? Yes, mentor. Here, brother.
This is the place. What was Lafreniere so interested in? Get him upstairs, quickly. Latouche, old friend. You do get about, don't you? because you know you're lying to me. <laughs> you haven't heard... Bloody fence sitter! Jesus! It's a corpse. It's the shop. Duh! Pay attention. Christ! Oh. Stop you! Right there! Here you are! Shit! I'd better keep my eyes open.
Christ! Focus. Focus. Oh. Pay attention. Damn traitor! Shit! You better keep me eyes open. Jesus! Dunno. And if you see <laughs> It was a crime worthy of death under Tiberius to praise Brutus. Caligula condemned to death those who were so sacrilegious as to... ...undress before the image of the Emperor. Once... Tyranny invented the crime of injured majesty, which were actions either indifferent or heroic. Who could have dared to think that it merited a punishment more gentle than death without rendering himself guilty of the same crime? When fanaticism, born of the monstrous union between ignorance and despotism, invented in its turn the crime of sacrilege, when it conceived in its delirium the project of avenging God himself, was it not necessary that they offer him blood and bring him down to their level, the monsters who said they were his image? The death penalty is necessary, say the partisans of ancient and barbarous routine. Without it, there is no break strong enough for crime. Who told you this? 
calculated all the gears by which penal laws can act on human sensibility. Alas, before death, how much physical and these politicians talking and they never shot me. Seeds before pride. The most imperious of all the passions. longer must we wait? I do have other business to tend to. <laughs> a little bit longer. The Grand Master wants the politicals thinned out before we begin. I trust we'll find it. I need an answer, friend. Recent activities. All will be made clear. I don't like it. The plan is still too vulnerable. <laughs> Let's not just ask the question. Just tell me what I want to do. But what? Well, after Nero's death. Hours ago, in fact. No need to make this any more. Convenient. Uh, that's the thing about assassins. Why them at a Templar conspiracy? They ask no questions. Or wait for the killer. Predictable talk, uh, mate. <laughs> Come, we'll fetch the cat when we get started. You finished? Near enough. Now here's the thing. I can go on like this all day. But you, you got an hour left in you? Two at the most. Half if I bring out the sharp bits. So why not skip the MB and go directly to me? Tell me where it is, and all this can be over. Luxembourg. What was that? Luxembourg. You're a smart man. Roy, clean up your mess, it's time. Be right there. You heard the weasel, boys? Did you really throw him out the Trash belongs in the gutter. Slop. Someone might have seen. Who? My boys are watching the whole place. They'll deal with any good Samaritans. They better. The Grand Master won't be happy if the whole plan comes unraveled because of one dead peon. Patience, my friend. If Paris must suffer a while longer so the world might be remade, then so be it. Why not just kill him and be done with it? One of my boys, a knife, a dark hallway. Easy peasy. We want a condemned man, Captain, not a martyr. Have patience. Respectfully, Grand Master, patience is well and fine. But the longer we wait, the greater the chance of discovery. Well, the assassins already found Siver and the Wadetun. Oh, Siver and Loire already served their purpose. Their destruction, while inconvenient, is no obstacle. 
And the assassins have already proved useful when properly led. What about the Della Sur brat? She could be dangerous if she manages to rally the old guard. That situation will be resolved. How so? Mademoiselle de la Serre will soon be on her way to l'Hôtel Voisin, eager to speak with Monsieur Lafreniere. Sadly, Monsieur Lafreniere has nothing left to say. Elise. Clever, Grandmaster. But you've had your brush with the assassins as well. Respectfully, you won't always be so lucky. Quite right. I shall leave the execution of our work to you good. Ladies and gentlemen, for my part, I shall retire to the sanctuary and await the final fate. Will that satisfy you, Captain? I'll see the watch triple. Very well. May the Father of Understanding guide you. May the Father of Understanding guide us. escaping on my watch. Under it! Die! <laughs> <laughs> 